to touch on um, something that Anna brought up, which is the lost and found. Lost and found at the club is, and at the Hall Commons. The Hall Commons Lost and Found is brought over to Love Library when Love South opens. So when Love South opens, the Lost and Found from the Hall Commons comes over. It's only brought over once a day unless it is a, an expensive item. If a phone, an ID, anything like that, then it needs to be brought over to Love South right away. Um, sorry, that just... Uh, was something that I thought we needed to bring up. For, I'm going to show you how to find the service desk schedules. The service desk schedules are online on the lift guide. So I'm just going to open that up. Sorry. On the lip guide, there are two different places where the schedules are. There is the service point schedules. On there, you'll see links to the uh, staff comment schedules as well as the student schedule. Um, if you click on those, that takes you to the schedule as it was that week. I, I stole this from Lib Staffer, so um, if there's a, a different one, let me know, and I can link that to there. Sorry, I got out of it. I'm not used to this computer. The second floor schedule is also on there. Again, this is from Lip Staffer. It was for that week. Um, I'm not sure. Does that schedule change much, Anna? Yeah, it will be due for the fall semester. I can send you a PDF. The user services student schedules are also online. They're laid out a little bit differently. As you can see, the uh, desks are distinguished by the rows. So at set from 7.15 to 8 at the left south desk on last Friday, it was Amy and Chelsea, the southeast desk, Mina, Southwest, Ulysses, and in the, sorry, in the comments was Jade. They are laid out by the hour because our students have various schedules, so it's laid out by the hour and by the day. This is the last one for this week. The next one that will go up will be the fall schedule. And it's actually already up, up there it's right here. So that one will go down and this one will go up. So if you are not sure who you're supposed to be working with, this is a great place to look. There are some changes that happen as students often will take time off. They are required to, the students are required to replace themselves if they cannot work. And there is a link to that form under the student workers tab on the LibGuide. It has, it also has the Slack information and the Lib Answers information. Um, for the students that we do, so if they're not sure what that is, this is where that's found. The student schedules are under the student tab, as well as the shift change requests. These are requests off. If no one is found for that shift, they are responsible for the shift. So. Kenneth has mono. I'm sorry, Kenneth. Um, so, so I put her out for next week. 
but they are responsible for filling their own shifts. They do their own schedules, uh, or they, they put on when they are available, so they let me know when they are available. I schedule them appropriately, and, and we work on it. They are required to find their own replacements. So if nobody is showing up for a shift and you're alone, this includes the students. Call. Let me know where uh, that somebody isn't, isn't in the space. If you're at the learning commons and it's during business hours or when the library is open, call the Love South desk and we will send somebody over. And there should be a student there and say you're a student and you're working the 11 p.m. to 1 a.m. shift, we need to know. And there is contact information available for that student to, to call. Hopefully it is before Michael leaves and Michael can call them. But the students overnight work independent of a, a library supervisor. So the CSO is there. But the students that are working need to call and work with each other. They need to let them know if they're going to be late. If they are not going to be there at all, they also need to replace themselves. So is there any questions on schedules and where to find them? And Can you get to this LibGuide? The, the LibGuide, there is a shortcut to the LibGuide on all of the Love Library and on the Commons computers. But not on, on my on office. The, on the circulation computers. Right, not on the office ones. But. It is, the link to the LibGuide is unl.libguides.com. It's, it's also on the, the top page of the internet. Yeah, it's on the internet as well. Intranet. Intranet. Any other questions? There's lots of very useful information on the Look Guides. Mm -hmm. If you have not taken a look at it, please do. There is a table of contents that goes directly to that page. And Robert and Anna are adding things to the to the lib guide that are important for the service points. This isn't just for for us; it is for all of the units, uh, all of the service points.